Hello and welcome to Afternoon Live. It's sunshine and rainbows inside, but outside, not so much. That's a shot from our Portland Riverfront camera, downtown Portland. Thank you so much for joining us today. We've got a great show for you, full of great holiday gift ideas. Let's start with the wine lover in your life. Are you wondering what to buy besides the wine? Well, our first guest is the expert and is here today with fun gadgets and gifts. We welcome back Pat the Wine Guy. Hey, Trey. Helber. Got yeah. me dancing. Because I'm a wine lover and you have all these treats. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully you'll be you, dancing for the next six, seven minutes. It's going to work out. You never know what to expect with me, do you? Not really. That's no. okay. I like to keep my guests all surprised. But you're surprising me today with these gadgets because I love little stocking stuffers and things to accompany We've got the em. wine. We've got them, yeah. And if you do have a wine lover in your life, you know you can buy them wine. Yeah, I know. But if they're like me, they're going to buy wine for themselves Ex anyway. That's what I'm yeah. saying. So, so you want to do something that they probably wouldn't do, but yeah. that they would love anyway. And there's a huge variety, believe me, of wine-related holiday gift items. We've got a number of them today. Okay. By the way, every one of these gifts we're going to show you in the next several minutes, we've got links, uh, information about them on our okay. website. Oh, good. At okay. the Com. Perfect. Yeah. Where are we starting? We're starting with a wine game. Oh. Okay. Oh. It's called Wine Smarts. And what Wine Smarts is, it's a fun game. It's a, It's not necessarily a drinking game, but you can have a glass of wine while you're playing Because, wait, it. I was going to say, how smart can you get after you've had a couple <laughs> of glasses of wine? You don't have to drink. You can drink. <laughs> but what it does, it tests your knowledge about wine and oh. wine grapes and regions and general wine information. Oh. And what you do is you uh, have a number of friends and you mm -hmm. ask yourself questions off cards. Uh-oh. Such oh, as. come on. I wasn't ready for a quiz. You know what a magnum is, right? Large format wine bottle? Big wine bottle? Sure, yes, of course I knew that. Okay, Trey, here's your question. How large is a magnum? A, two standard bottles. B, three standard bottles. C, not large enough. <laughs> I think I like not I large know, enough. <laughs> as much as you like, it's not C, okay, it's okay, A, okay. two uh, standard bottles. It really? Yeah. And there's something that actually holds that much? Oh, yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's what well, I'm talking about. We have to do a segment about. on magnums. I can see I that in the so. future. I think so. Absolutely. Yeah. Anyway, so I that's Wine really Smarts, and it's, it's a fun game. And the uh, questions are good for experts as well as people who don't know a lot about wine. It goes everywhere in between. This is perfect for the person who thinks they know it all. Per yes. And you can get them, like, in a corner. I got some wrong. <laughs> You did? Yes. Oh my yeah, gosh, that. that's terrible. I don't know if I could play that. Okay, okay, now more wine knowledge here. Now, we've talked before on your show when you got white wine or rosé in a glass. Yes. You want to keep it cool. Right, right. You don't want to put ice cubes in it because... Well, it dilutes the wine. Very good. See? Yes. <laughs> I could be wine smart. Yeah, you're wine smart. Okay. It dilutes the flavor and the intensity of the wine. Mm -hmm. So, here's a, p a potential solution. What do you do? Wine twirls. Now, if you're familiar with whiskey oh. stones, yes, I do. Ha yes, very similar in concept. Oops. You freeze these guys, right? Put one of them in your glass, uh huh. And this should keep your riesling. Well, you know, this could keep your riesling cool for the rest of this program. Really? So you might want to just an hour. refer back to this class <laughs> as you go. I like it. He said it. He said it, boss. <laughs> Not me. All show long. Just got it. So, I got to do a temperature check. At least, there you go. I have to do it. Temperature check. Yeah, at least a half hour. It'll keep a glass of wine Very cool for nice a and half chill. hour. Yeah. Now this is really genius, though. So that yeah. obviously it's not ice. It doesn't melt. There's no water. It's just cold. All the above. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, so I that's like wine these, from. and they're cute. Okay. So here's another situation. Mm -hmm. Do you like to take a bath? I love to take a do bath. You like to drink wine. I love to drink. How wine. do you do both at the same time? With the Sipsky no. bathtub wine. No, <laughs> stop the madness right now. A suction cup for your I, wine glass? Stop it! I didn't make any of this stuff up. It's so, <laughs> there's so much stuff online. Okay, it. what you've got here is a little <laughs> container here. So right. you basically put your little stemmed glass in. Yes. This is adhesive. You put it on the side of the bathtub wall and you sip and you soak. Simultaneously. And you never get out and you turn into a raisin. <laughs> now, that one thing, is the plan. One thing this, uh, this manufacturer did recommend, you shouldn't have necessarily a glass, stemmed wine glass, but you oh. should have a plastic stemmed wine glass. Because oh, you drop a wine glass in a bathtub, in bad consequences there. Ooh, yeah. yeah, but this is so cool. People think of everything. I know. <laughs> this yeah. is crazy. And it doubles for a shower, too. If you, <laughs> if you like to drink wine and take a shower at the same time, God bless you. I um, think that <laughs> might be dangerous, but you never know. People, hey, look, no judgments. No judgments. All okay, right, all right. Moving all right. right along, glasses. Speaking of glasses, mm -hmm. 
There are dozens, if not hundreds, of novelty wine glasses out there with every possible sentiment printed on them that you could imagine. <laughs> a lot of them not suitable for an afternoon television right, show. Right, right, because yes. I've seen some where yes. I was like, please, we can't show this. So we tried to select one today that we thought, okay, this is kind of neutral and everybody can relate to it, and it is... What does it say? I had to deal with people today. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's good. And the, most of the time, there, right? you do need a good old glass of yeah. wine after a long day of dealing, dealing with, with people. people. Along those same lines, wine socks. Yes, 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 yes. Can I just say, okay. Do you have wine socks? I do have oh wine socks. I, <laughs> that is you unbelievable. You know the kind that say, wait, I don't want to ruin, okay, oh. never mind. I'm not going to say anything. Let me see what you, you have, have first. You have wine socks. I don't have these wine socks. These are adorable, by the way. Well, once I love again, socks. <laughs> every, every possible <laughs> phrase you can think of is printed on a wine sock. And we tried to, well, we were thinking about the hardworking mom who comes home yeah, after a long let's day. Yeah, talk about her. Wait, let me check my temperature. <laughs> Gotta right. check the temperature. Yes. Mom's had a hard day, comes home, kicks up, on the, uh, kicks up the feet on the lazy boy, and she uh, has her wine socks on that say, <laughs> Mom off duty. I love it. Bring wine. I love it. Okay, the ones I have say, if you can read this, bring, bring me, a me a glass, glass of, of wine. wine. Yeah, and exactly. I put them on as often yeah. as I can. Often Very good. Like Somebody's got a pair of wine socks. Okay, now, <laughs> now along the same lines, apparel, shirts, t-shirts, yes. hoodies, sweatshirts, hats, everything you can imagine with a wine phrase on it. Some of them good, some of them not so good. And the thing is, with a lot of people on your list, you know, they have different personalities. Right. So we picked out a shirt here for someone who is maybe a little sarcastic on your list, maybe mm. a little curmudgeonly. Wonder who that could possibly be. This Anyone might, I know? This might be your new shirt. <laughs> I like wine. And maybe three people. <laughs> I think that's adorable. And everybody knows I love a good graphic tee. Cassie, don't I love a good graphic tee? Yeah, this might be on the show tomorrow. Merry Christmas. <laughs> now, little participation on your part here. Oh, as we, okay. Yeah. Oh, there you go. All right. Uh -huh. That's not what I was referring oh. to, but right. um, sure. Put this around your neck. Really? Yes, put that around your neck. Okay. You need to come back, grab this. Okay. Like this? That'll work. Okay. All right. Put this in the oh. opening. <laughs> oh, you're kidding me. This is a wine glass holder lanyard. OMG, I so think you might I'm ask, in love. You might ask, why do you need a wine glass holder <laughs> lanyard? I would never ask that, but someone might. Free up your hands, double dipping at the appetizer table, right, at a party. <gasps> you know I don't double dip. Okay, all right. But, but. What if you're an exp <laughs> You know, there's nothing wrong with a little twist and dip. If you're twist. an expressive person who talks with their hands, Me, yes. you can communicate. But fully. how do you, you would totally just draw attention to this. This is totally a conversation <laughs> every piece. Time, no way in the world. Every time I look at this, I think of a party <laughs> with 20 or 30 people and they've all got one on, right? <laughs> Everybody has one of these things around <laughs> their neck. No, we have all of these things on. The shirt, the socks, this, everything. As a matter of fact, thanks for coming, Pat. Good to see you. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Thank you so Merry much. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Oh my gosh, you guys, we're going to have these gadgets and more information. Can you about wear that the rest of the Pat show? Pat the Wine Guy, I would love to. <laughs> On our website at katu.com. All right, coming up next, we are making a Puerto Rican hot toddy. Maybe it'll fit in here too. Oh, yeah. You never know. Oh, yeah. All right, we'll be right back.